My expectations, um, you know, are very high. I mean, I think that, um, you know, we've obviously, you know, got a great group of guys. I think we've had a really good camp. Obviously, we've had, you know, a couple guys uh, deal with some injuries already, but but we know that that's, that's going to happen. And, um, you know, I think that we've kind of weathered that storm in years past and obviously feel great about the depth that we have in place. So I think our guys are in a good place and, you know, we're excited to, uh, you know, get on that plane, get back up to New York and get the season started, get back in front of our fans in front of the, um, or back at the stadium this weekend. And uh, it's going to be fun. I think so for, 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 for both those reasons, definitely. Um, you know, obviously playing in front of a empty Yankee stadium last year, even if it was only for 30 games, it was definitely, um, you know, an eerie feeling. So I know our fans are excited to get back in the seats. Obviously we're, we're excited to play in front of them and um, excited to see Garrett Cole take the mound on opening day and those pinstripes and yeah, just the additions that we've made over the winter. Uh, I feel really good about the group of guys that we have and uh, hopefully we'll be giving the fans a lot to cheer about this season. Right. Uh, physically, um, you know, I feel like my body's in a good place. I feel like my swing has come along. I feel good about the work I've been able to get in, even in days that I'm not playing. Um, we've been able to get a lot of work in down here and I feel like, yeah, I'm in a great place, ready for the season to start. And I'm um, excited to see where it takes us. High quality. I mean, you know, obviously, um, you know, the expectations with, with the Yankees never, never really change every year. Um, you know, we've got our eyes set on that ultimate, ultimate prize. And obviously, you know, it's been way, way too long since we've been back to the World Series. And obviously, um, we've put a lot of work in and we've come up just short the last few years. But I do feel like we've got a really, really good team. And I like our chances. And, and um, you know, just just take things one day at a time and try and keep guys healthy. And um, and as I said earlier, just see where it takes us. But I expect it to be a expect it to be a fun year. Um, yeah, I mean, every every one of them is, is special for their own reasons. I mean, every year you have a little different group of guys. You're always um, there's a couple guys that are maybe new on the team and a couple guys that have been on the team for a while. They're that are missing. So every year is a little different because you're kind of going at it with a, with a different group of guys and there's a little different dynamic to the team, but every opening day is special. Um, and especially, um, anytime we can open at home, um, you know, they're in the Bronx in front of our fans. It'll be a special one this year for sure. And I've been looking forward to it for a long time. Um, you know, every year you get asked to compare teams, um, you know, the current team, the teams from years past. And, you know, I think the team is, is similar in a lot of ways. I mean, I, I like the pitching additions that we made in the off season, obviously, We've got a few guys that, um, you know, a guy in particular, Corey Kluber, we've seen what he's able to do in the past when he's healthy and, um, you know, look forward to him taking the ball for us every five days and, and, and watching him work. Um, it's been a lot of fun to get to know him in spring and watch him go about his business. Um, and, you know, JT be able to get him over from the Pirates. I know Garrett was excited about that. And obviously um, he had nothing but great things to say about him. And then obviously meeting him. Um, you know, it's been great getting to know him too. Look forward to, to seeing him finally healthy and, and back on the mound for a full season. And, and obviously, um, you know, being able to get Seve back, having Domingo back, just a lot of additions that we haven't had uh, in years past. And, um, you know, looking forward to seeing those guys at work. Hey, Brett, there's been a lot of excitement about Giancarlo Stanton since he got here, but the injuries have kind of taken away from that, from what you saw last postseason and what you're seeing this spring. What does he look like to you? He looks great. Um, you know, he, he looks like, um, you know, hasn't really, you know, skipped a beat from, from what I remember him being like last, um, last October, obviously. And, and this spring he's been hitting the ball hard. He's been working really, really hard. He's healthy and, you know, expecting a big season out of him as well as a lot of other guys on our team. But, um, you know, he's a guy that as we've seen in the past is really, um, you know, really capable of impacting the baseball and, and impacting the outcome of the game. And, um, uh, you know, looking forward to seeing him play in a full season and um, seeing what he can really do.